Hey, this month is National Blood Pressure Month, along with cardiovascular issues. That's a good thing to think about here in May. And a couple things I'd like to talk about are really what affect blood pressure in the body. Stress is a major cause of blood pressure issues in the body, and we can test for that. We use the organic acids test to really see what is the underlying issue that's occurring there. And that test itself is a simple test that you take home and do and send in. And it looks at 43 different metabolites in the body, looking at B vitamins, how well you're utilizing those for energy and fats for energy too, so how your mitochondria are functioning the way they're supposed to in, in getting you energy and producing energy for yourself. It looks at detoxification, how well your liver and kidneys are detoxifying. It looks at if there's any dysbiosis that's occurring in the small or large intestine or bacterial changes there that can cause issues through the body itself. It also looks at nerve inflammation and your body's ability to handle the stress response. And that inability for that stress response to be able to work correctly is really a big factor factor in affecting blood pressure in the body. As we have increase in cortisol, which is a hormone in the stress response, as that metabolizes down to cortisone, if we see that occurring quite a bit, then it can also affect what's called aldosterone, which is a hormone released by the adrenal glands. That affects blood pressure. So the more stress you have, the more cortisol being produced, the more breakdown occurs to cortisone, the more aldosterone is being produced, which increases blood pressure itself. So we can tell from the testing that we do what occurs. The OAT test is a really wonderful exam. It's called the organic acid test that looks at those 43 metabolites to see what's going on. It also looks at cellular inflammation too in the body that we can tell are your cells inflamed from there. Uh, then from looking at that test we can see do we need to do what's called the Dutch test, the dried urine to test complete hormones. That one itself is fantastic too because that's going to look really specifically at the cortisol, the cortisone along with the other hormones in the body and their metabolites to really see what's going on. Those two tests combine to really tell us what is going on with your system, where things are going wrong and how to correct it, and really leads us down the path of why do you have high blood pressure. It also affects cholesterol issues in the body, cardiovascular risk associated with it. So we like to run those tests to really see what's going on and how to correct that underlying issue, that root cause of what's causing your blood pressure issues. So if it's something you're interested in getting your blood pressure checked out, figuring out how to maybe correct it and getting off some medications, we'll work with your primary care or your cardiologist to get you off of those medications as we get you better. Get a call, get us a give us a call and get scheduled. We'll talk to you soon. Happy National Blood Pressure Month. Thank you.